Uh, hi everyone, uh, this will be a tutorial for the um, riffle, riffle, strip, riffle, cut sequence um, and it uh, retains only the top stock, so not the full deck order. Uh, so let's say that there are uh, four uh, sevens on top and you want to maintain them there. So um, the sequence would look like this. First, there are uh, two riffles, uh, and a strip, and then another riffle, and then a final cut. And the uh, sevens are still on the top of the deck. Um, so here's the tutorial part. Uh, so four sevens are on the top first as you could see in the uh, demo I did two riffles and I uh, did two standard um, zero shuffles but uh, so what I did is uh, I cut to the left I started a zero shuffle so starting with the uh, left hand packet like that and then ending with the uh, left hand packet too, but maintaining two cards, uh, two sevens in this case, and then uh, finishing off with the uh, right hand packet, and then, uh, well, finishing off with the left hand, uh, and then uh, do a zero, so a standard zero, where you uh, disconnect the, uh, the uh, riffled part. Uh, so what I mean is this, so, and then you do a second uh, uh, shuffle, uh, here, disconnecting this here, and then bringing the, this a bit forward. Uh, so now the four sevens are still on the top. Let's do that again. Riffle uh, by uh, beginning uh, with the uh, left hand packet, and then fini finishing off with the left hand here. It should look something like this. So I have four, uh, two sevens here. Uh, some random cards here, and then two uh, two uh, sevens over here. I can't really show it here, and then do uh, a zero like this. So now I have sevens uh, here and sevens here. Then again, cut to the left. Uh, begin with the left hand packet. Uh, keep two cards on the left hand packet. Uh, and the right hand packet doesn't really matter how many cards you have left here uh, because you're gonna disconnect this part again like that and yeah well pushing a bit forward on that uh, card as you can see uh, and uh, so yeah four sounds are still on the top from here uh, you're gonna do some strip cuts and uh, the first packet that you're gonna do, uh, take is, uh, is about half of the deck you'll see why in a moment and then the next packet you're gonna out jog it like that and then you're gonna finish off the strip now this packet here that we out jog needs to uh, be out uh, still have, oh, needs to be out jog so that uh, from here you can lift up at the break because the sevens are here and uh, those are the cards of interest so you're gonna lift up uh, hold a break and then from here you're gonna uh, riffle off two cards one two and then uh, from here watch out you're gonna uh, cut the top packet to the right because here um, you have uh, sevens, four sevens, and two random cards on top of that. So you could you cut that to the right. Again, start with the uh, left hand packet, riffle off, uh, keeping two cards on the left, and then from here you're gonna do a standard zero shuffle, keeping a break. And then from here, you can finish the cut like that, and. Uh, the four sevens are uh, maintained on the top. Now, 
I used uh, so for the zero shuffles I did it with uh, I maintain two cards each time of course you can do it with only one card I prefer doing it with that, that's what I mean by uh, beginning with the uh, left hand packet if you start with the right hand it's a bit messy it's a bit more not difficult but you have a smaller chance of uh, well getting this packet inside of there uh, I don't remember yep. from here I can finish off the, the shuffle so one uh, one card so the same thing with the uh, strip cuts from here you can uh, riffle off only one card and then do the same thing as you can see here and then maintain and then uh, for the zero shuffle you're gonna maintain of course only one card here and then finish off by um, uh, keeping a break and cutting the deck uh, so yeah that was the tutorial uh, for the um, the uh, riffle riffle strip riffle cut uh, using zero shuffles and uh, and uh, well yeah as you can see strip cuts and a normal cut I uh, hope you enjoyed um, by the way I'm back from uh, holidays uh, from my holiday so um, this <laughs> this is <laughs> I have good news and bad news. The good news is that I'll probably I have a list of um, tutorials or things that I want to teach or show or just show it, like my deck collection or uh, the difference between uh, a table faro shuffle and a table perfect riffle shuffle and even do a tutorial of that uh, and some other stuff. Uh, that I like to show and the bad news is that I'll be gone for two more weeks uh, on a holiday so I won't be able to do any more tutorials if there is is no Wi-Fi uh, wi um, so I'll see if I can make uh, another tutorial otherwise it will be for uh, well, you'll have to wait until September uh so uh yeah uh again hope you enjoyed uh and uh bye